I've just realised this whole time I've been filming and the mic hasn't been on. So, welcome back to another video. Um, today is the day that we're taking the Defender down to the garage, basically. So, I've just got to the farm and basically we've got to take Scott's truck and a trailer and the telly hammer as well to lift the Land Rover on and off. So, it is a bit windy back here. But we have the mic. So, I'll try and talk you through what's happening. Yeah, let's go. Forgot to add the axle the axle? The chassis isn't here yet. And that's gonna be another like four two to four weeks. So Scott didn't shut my door, the door blew open in the wind. Anyway, so got another two to four week wait for the chassis. So nothing can be really done, it's just gonna be taken apart to see how much damage is been made. I think we're gonna go and get the bulkhead anyway. Ben said he's seen one, a galvanized one already. So I think we're gonna do that. We're gonna do it, we're gonna do it properly. So on the road she goes. So I've come to edit this video and basically realise I haven't spoken through any of the steps as to what's going on. So the boys in the these next few clips, basically they go backwards and forwards as to what works, what doesn't work and what have you as to trying to get the Land Rover on the trailer. As you can see, it took a little while to get it right and get strapped in properly just so then it was safe to take down to the garage because it wasn't like a little journey to be honest. Um, and we had to go through town and what have you so we wanted to make sure it was really safe and secure. So you can watch the boys going backwards and forwards trying to get it on before someone comes at me being like, you didn't help. No, I don't help when it comes to this stuff. All I do is get showered at. So I just stay out all the way and film it for you guys. So just for the next little while, this is the boys trying to get it on the trailer safely. Keep coming. Keep coming. Stop.
Long story short, this is us at the garage finally. Um, we had to put her in a particular spot, so Scott took a while to get her into the back of the garage in the corner, but nonetheless, he did a really good job of it, to be honest. Um, and we even tried to start her up, so you can watch the clip of this to see whether she started or not. And that's the problem we have with their home, which everyone's more off. upset about that than the actual crash. <laughs> so i've just come to edit the end of the video and i realized like i haven't finished it whatsoever so it's now at the garage obviously like i said the chassis isn't coming for another couple of weeks so there's not a lot going on to be honest it's just being taken apart so i won't be doing another update not next week i think it'll be the following week so and then it'll go into every week i will do an update as to what is going on so we're gonna go down every i think wednesday but it'll be uploaded on friday and you can see all the updates going on and the rebuild basically but subscribe if you want to see all the steps to her being rebuilt and what we do next